Hey friends, how's it going? For today's video, I am watching the 2006 film The Prestige starring Hugh Jackman and Christian Bale. It's like a psychological thriller and there's magicians and magic. That's all I really know. I know that the casting is amazing. I love Christian Bale. I love Hugh Jackman. As actors, they're phenomenal. So to see them playing two lead roles together, I'm excited to see that. You guys have said nothing but great things about it, so I'm excited to jump into it. If by chance you like the video and you want to help support me and my content, help me continue doing what I friggin' love, the link to my Patreon will be down below in the description. There you will see full-length reactions, commentary review for everything, every show, every movie, everything I've ever watched. That's something you're interested in doing, which does help the channel so incredibly much. Um, I highly recommend checking it out. So without further ado, let's get into The Prestige. Are you guys ready? Three, two, one, go. Is this close enough? Yes. I'm gonna ASMR the entire chant, the entire time. Is it just silent? It's just silent, isn't it? Oh my gosh, if it's not silent, I'm gonna be so upset. There's no way it's still silent. I've, I'm scared my ears are gonna get blasted. That was gonna be like a horse clip clopping or something. The, rep the prestige. Oh, look at the amount of top hats. Are you watching closely? Oh my god. Oh, stop! Stop it! Stop! <laughs> that jump scared me! <gasps> okay. The magic trick consists of three oh! parts. The first part is I didn't know you were in the this. Glitch. The magician shows you something ordinary. Yeah, an order. No, it probably isn't. Oh, the bloody axe, you <laughs> fool! The second act is called the turn. The magician takes the ordinary something. That's ordinary? Something extraordinary. He's gonna electrocute himself. They're not familiar with electricity there. You're not really looking. You want to be fooled. But you wouldn't clap yet. You have to bring it back. Every magic trick has a third act. The prestige. Oh, that's what it's called. <gasps> Is he gonna kill him? Stop. And did Robert Angier sure, get to that final part of his trick that night? Uh, no, sir. It was Borden watching Mr. Scene, Angier drown. Wait, Hugh Jackman's in this for like two seconds? The tank was brought on for the first trick and then taken off stage. How do you think Mr. Borden was able to move the tank under the trap door without anyone noticing? He's a magician. Ask him. <laughs> get right. Prepare to disclose the details to me in private. Might this be an acceptable compromise? Turn out your pockets. Oh, the warden saw his show in Manchester last year where he vanished into thin air. I represent Lord Cordler, an accomplished amateur magician, and... How much for my tricks? Five thousand pounds. Talk with Fallon. He offered to sell me your tricks. All except the most valuable. Well, I wouldn't forgive myself for selling my greatest trick. Even for your daughter. Oh, that was his daughter. As Lord Cordler's ward, she will want for nothing. As a show of good faith, it's Robert Andrew's diary. If you want Andrew's secrets, you go dig him up and ask him yourself. I want your secret, Mr. Borden. There's a reason, because it's the best. I didn't know there was like so much high value for like magic tricks. Tricks from the Cipher. Search. Even if Colorado is the end of my journey, it'll take much longer to unravel. Lefty, who's a lefty here? Hugh Jackman's a lefty? See, the cipher in his notebook is unlocked by a single word, but it'll still take months to translate his writing and to know his mind. Colorado Springs? I was close there. I've only been to Colorado once, and it was like four hot springs. The whole town has electricity. Sure. I will uh, need a coach tomorrow to take me up the mountain. It looks beautiful. I mean, not this shot, but with the mountains. I want to see it. You'll have to walk a rest, I'm afraid, sir. How many of you newspaper writers can't read my sign? I saw your show in London. I've come to see Tesla. Nikola Tesla? I'm sorry, Mr. Angier. I simply can't help you. Hey, what, what am I holding? Your watch. Vouch for him. For April 3rd, 1897. We were two young men at the start of a great career. Two young men who never intended to hurt anyone. If you would tie her wrist, bind her feet. I'm sure you can both tie a strong knot. It's a stranger. Are 
He's complacent. He's predictable. He's boring. Oh, they do know each other. Okay. Real magician tries to invent something new that other magicians are going to scratch their heads over, you know? His accent is really good. Go to the Tenley. There's a Chinaman there, and he really has what it takes. And whichever one of you can tell me how he does a goldfish bowl trick gets the prize. I saw you uh, drop the knot again. The Langford double will hold tighter. It's too dangerous. No more mistakes. If I can see you kissing your wife's leg every night, so can the blokes at the ends of row three and four. Oh, oh, they're married. I love watching magic tricks and then trying to figure them out. Can't be. No, it is. Look at the man. This is why no one can detect his method. Total devotion to his art. I can barely lift this thing. It's not even filled with water. How would he do that without arms? He's been pretending to be a cripple for years. Hmm. I couldn't fathom it. I've thought of a name for you. The Great Dan Tong. But it's sophisticated. It's French. Why doesn't he like it being French? Hmm? What's that about? But what does he know of self-sacrifice? He killed it! He's alive! He's alright, he's fine. But where's his brother? <laughs> he's a sharp lad. He's, um, he's my nephew. So did he actually kill the bird? Did he actually? You're the lucky one today. <gasps> They're actually killing the birds, bro? What? Oh my god, dude. They'll beg you and they'll flatter you for the secret, but as soon as you give it up, you'll be nothing to them. Thank you for lunch, Mr. Porter. You're welcome. He likes her. I'll use a cup of tea. Candleize the landlord. So uh, I'll see you again. Milk and sugar. Huh? Wait, literally, how did he do that? I don't know, we could teleport. Angie's machine. This was built by a wizard. Nikola Tesla? Well, they've been sold to Lord Caldwell. Don't let him take this. This is the tank Angie drowned in? Yes. Place where the performer's hand reaches through. It's been switched for a real one. What a way to kill someone. This water tank was of particular significance to these two men. Awful significance. Awful significance. Around the ankle. He's doing the knot that he was told not to do. How do they not get caught? I, I'm assuming more, like, people go to the show more than once. A minute? And she's... She can't do it. <gasps> oh, no, 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 no. Tell me she does not drown. She does not drown. She died because of the knot he said not to do. I knew an old sailor once. He went overboard. He pulled him out. He said it was like going home. I'm sorry for your loss, Angie. Which knot did you tie? I just don't know. You don't know? We got our first booking today. I don't think we've had the pleasure. I can't afford to pay The you. money will come when we get the audience. Yes. And I'll share half my food with him or something. You're already going to be doing that with someone else. You're having a, a baby. They're having a baby. That was the girl. That was the blonde girl. Run of the mill daring spectacular bullet catch. A bullet catch? Yeah, but it's safe. I promise. I don't believe that anybody who has said the bullet catch is safe. It is never safe. Go on, shoot me. Right there. That oh! <laughs> Tell me how you do it. No, I can't do that. Well, then you can't do it. You don't tell anybody that I told you. Gunpowder. Hold out your hand. Once you know, it's actually very obvious. <laughs> hey, look how disappointed he looked. He was like... I love you very much. Not today. Well, some days it's not true, and today you don't mean it. I like being able to, to tell the difference. It makes the, the days it is true mean something. I mean, just because he loves magic doesn't mean he doesn't love you. <laughs> like you this is what you came for, is it? <laughs> Who wants to volunteer? He put his own bullet in. Which knot did you tie, board? I don't know. Why are they laughing? No, this is like serious. I can never know for sure. How can he not know? I mean, couldn't you tell when they were untying her wrists? Like you can tell by the knot. Sarah, that bloody hurts. 
I need this to heal, so I can get back to work. What tricks can you possibly perform with this kind of injury? I can do some prop tricks. I can do the trick that I've been telling you about. Come on. So why isn't she in the picture? They said the daughter is an orphan. I want to keep on working. We'll have to whitewash your windows. Have you settled on a name? Great Danton. I don't want to kill doves. Then stay Thank off the you. stage. You're a magician, not a wizard. <laughs> he doesn't have to kill anything. Do not kill. No point in meeting Mr. Angie. Scarlett Johansson? Okay. Goodness. Breathe as little as possible. That's comforting. She takes a job. First day on the job. Breathe as little as possible. Please don't kill him. I will require the assistance of two volunteers. Mr. Merritt, if you would oblige me. Mr. Merritt, if you'll place your hands on either side of the cage. God. Very nice. Yay! Very nice. Uh, if your tricks don't get him in, somebody else's will. Maybe somebody willing to do a bullet catch? Cheap frills, Mr. Murray. Always comes to the rescue with such elegance. I love him. Thank you. The champagne ready. I have a feeling it's not gonna go well. Oh my gosh, I have a feeling it's not gonna go well. Oh, this is too tense. Two volunteers, please. A lady and a gentleman. Madam, if you place one hand on the back of the cage, one hand on the front. Oh my gosh, they're gonna get like dead bird stuff all over everybody's hands. I can't do this. No! Oh, well, don't suppose they'll let us do this again. You don't have a show. Anything here in the morning gets burned. It's a technical exposition at the Albert Hall this week. That sort of thing captures the public's imagination. Tesla built one for another magician. Finish your drink. That's smirk. He's like, finish your drink. Tesla electrified the whole town in exchange for using the generators when we need to. We do our tests when the townspeople are asleep. Kind of pretty, especially if that's something people aren't used to. Where are the wires? Exactly. Real magic. The miracle of Nikola Tesla, ladies and gentlemen. I didn't think Nikola Tesla was gonna be involved in a magician movie, but here we are. He must have been deemed a true magician at, of the time. Part of Thomas Edison's smear campaign against Mr. Tesla's superior alternating- Agreed. Definitely agreed. We are not Edison fans. See, today it's true. His notebook reveals that he never had the life that I envied. His mind is a divided one. I've dealt with someone like that. Tell others I've reconsidered. Take it. I'm gonna learn all the professor's secrets. Only if I teach you how to read. <laughs> Get wrecked. I'll call you one day, Will Locks, Professor. Maybe one day I'll uh, ask, are you watching closely? And then I'll be. God. <laughs> How do you get so famous then, eh? How'd you? Hit him with the ball. Hit him with the ball. Oh, wait, how did he do that? That's amazing. <laughs> I like that he's like bullying the guards that are bullying him. I wonder how they're gonna depict Tesla. What? Have you eaten, Mr. Angier? Beautiful. Oh, that looks delicious. I wish I was there. Society only tolerates one change at a time. I was hailed as a visionary. Second time, I was asked politely to retire. <laughs> Go home. Forget this thing. I can recognize an obsession. What well, hasn't good come of your obsessions? I am their slave. And one day they will choose to destroy me. I gotta say, there's beauty in that entire sentiment. No, you won't change my mind. I've already begun to build it, Mr. Angier. I hope you enjoy the mountain air. That's really fascinating, the quote, like, He's just become a slave to his obsession, and it will essentially be his demise. Because I feel like it's really easy for somebody to fall into obsession, right? Whether whatever it could be, their passion, like healthy, unhealthy, it uh changes you. I don't really have anywhere to go. You've been sleeping here. Kata said it would be all right to get another booking. You're going to do something to that man, aren't you? You're going to need a better disguise. Are they gonna kill him? Or, or try to- sorry, I know he's in jail, like he's not gonna die, but... Did you hurt him? Not a normal rubber ball. He had a new trick. Was it good? It was the greatest magic trick I've ever seen. 
Did they applaud when you saw it? The trick was too good. It was too simple. He uses a double. It's too simple. This is a complex illusion. It's the same man. If you look closely, you can tell. He doesn't know how to sell his trick to an audience, but I do. Yeah, well, we can use it as a climax of the show. But you have to figure it out first. Only way that I know how to do it is to find you a bloody good double. Well, let's get out there and find me. What's that? It's for you. What's this for? The mother's dress is really pretty. <laughs> Soon you'll be in a bigger theatre. Things will work out. <laughs> so he loves her, he does, but it's just, he is in cahoots between his family and his passion and it's tearing him apart. That's kind of sad. I'd like you to meet Gerald Root. Mm -hmm. Would you like for me to tell you a little joke? <coughs> Are you laughing now? I have to take a piss. <laughs> oh my gosh, him? He looks just like him. Give me a month. <laughs> Couldn't you have found a softer one? Well, it's not for sleeping on. It's going to be amazing, Robert. Well, it has to be. <laughs> He's a little drunk there, huh? Would you favor us with a performance, Mr. Root? Do you have faith? You can go back to being yourself now, Root. I'd rather be him for now. Looks like you have an evil twin. I think the evil twin did something bad, and that's what gets him killed. Have you thought what we should call the trick? Borden calls his trick the transported man. You cannot claim this next feat as illusion. What you're about to see is considered safe. They did that very well. That was really well executed, actually. That's so nerve wracking. Making sure that's perfect. How did you get up there so quick? <laughs> to our achievements. Mm -hmm. Maybe we could switch before the trick. That way I can be the prestige and Root ends up below stage. No, the anticipation of the trick is everything. Agreed. Danton. Get out of that wardrobe and makeup. They're kind of mean to him. I feel bad. It's a trick. It isn't good enough. Oh my God, that's going to be your downfall. I need you to go and work for him. Work for him? Are you joking? You'll be my spy. Why would he trust me? Because you're going to tell him the truth. His obsession is a little bit too much. Your head. I don't understand. Perhaps it would be uh, best if you left us to it. Test that doesn't look very safe. You really steal the rest of my show? No, I'm here to give your show what it's missing. Me. I've left Angier. I am here because he sent me here. Well, what was he my secret for? His trick is top notch. He reappears instantly. On the other side of the stage. And unless I'm mistaken, very drunk. <laughs> it's astonishing. How's he do it? <laughs> astonishing. How's he do it? He sent me here to steal your secrets, but I've actually come to offer you his. Get down below stairs right away. No. You're the great Danton, aren't you? <laughs> We paid him enough to keep him in beer, so... I'm only doing one show, but to be frank, my people pretty much run things these days. Get up there! <gasps> oh my god! A similar trick in my act, and uh, I used a double. When I incorporated this bloke... He planted it into his mind. Yeah, complete power over me. Complete power, you say? <laughs> Why did he make that face? He was like... Yes, thank you for the warning. Don't stop. Just stop doing the trip trick. Stop it. <gasps> Bro, what is wrong with this movie? <sighs> Dude, what is wrong with this entire movie? <sighs> I hate this. I hate this. I hate this. I just want them to be best friends. Too much damage, but I just, just want them to be friends. <laughs> Oh. I apologize. He's such a bully. He, bro. Too much magic for my stage at the Pantages. That's disgusting. You killed his wife. What's wrong with you? You're psychotic, man. Don't know how Bolden found him. Yeah, well, he did. Disgusting. Do you think it was her? You weren't expecting me? How does he do it? He uses a double. Of course Borden said that. She fell in love with him. Just because you're sleeping with him doesn't mean he trusts you. The great Danton is a blind fool. His notebook. It's a cipher. Even with a keyword, it would take months to decode. If I don't get that back to him by tomorrow morning, he'll know I took it. It won't bring your wife back. I don't care about my wife. I care about his secret. Excuse me? What did you just say? He crossed the line. He knows it. I'll go to his workshop and stage a break-in. I have fallen in love with him. 
Jason's wife. I know how hard this has been for you. She is like a homewrecker. He has a family and a child. Uh, she's not doing anything, I hope. And he's just getting started. <laughs> I like her fit there. That outfit's cute. They're both in love with each other. I'm walking tonight. Just got real dirty real fast. You're finally getting your hands dirty. It's what a good trick costs, Jangia. Your method for the transport of man. You have my notebook. Describe it in full. The key word is the method. Where's mine, you know? I'll be asking you dick. Fallon! Did you find your answer? What does it mean? It means, Cutter, we have a journey ahead of us. Can't follow you any further in it. I'm glad that he knows his limits and his boundaries. I like how, like, kidnapping a guy and burying him alive isn't his boundary, but, like, going to America is. <laughs> I know it has to do with the obsession, but it's just funny. Champagne, your finest. We are celebrating. Well, we've hit upon a new trick. I am going to bury myself. And then someone will come along and dig me up. Uh, perhaps, Mr. Fallon, you might escort Miss Wentz come home. His wife deserves better. Absolutely. Why are you being like this, Alfred? I thought that something very precious had been lost. What did you lose? His dignity. Stop performing. He does care about his craft more than his family. I thought I had the place to myself, Mr. Brent. First, I thought they might work for the government. Worse, they work for Thomas Edison. Oh, that is worse. We hate Thomas Edison. Ask him about Topsy. <laughs> he sucked. He treated Tesla so horribly. You guys need to look into like the background of what Edison did to Tesla, like everything. That man sucked. I loved him and I stood by him and he sent me to you. I hate him. You may know how he does his tricks, but you can't understand why no one can see that yours are better. You hide this. Be so much more than he is and I can show you how. I think she's telling the truth, but I love her. He yeah, has a wife and a child. How could he send you away? She must help me rid ourselves of Angier. This is getting wild. I didn't realize how stressed I'd be watching this. She gave you this notebook at my request. Tesla is merely the key to my diary. Goodbye, Angie. He bamboozled him so hard and made him spend so much money. He's never going to get a secret. You stole my money. We have not stolen your money. My cat. When I told you I could make your machine, please, I spoke as... Please don't use, use an animal. Stop with the animal abuse, please. You need to try different material. It doesn't it provoke... conduct electricity the way a body can. Please. No! Why would you ever say yes? Why, my dude? Well, I hope that whatever you were really doing with my money was more worthwhile. Honestly, take the cat. The cat has a better home anywhere else than friggin' them running tests on it. Oh, that's what all those top hats were! There's a second cat, too! Oh, that makes so much more sense. Oh, oh wait, do that Do it with more cats! Make more cats. These things never quite work as you expect them to, Mr. Angier. I'll need a couple of weeks to iron out the problems with the machine. Making another human a clone? You look so pretty in this new dress of yours. If only you loved her. Daddy will go run his errands and I'll be back before you know it, so you go get ready. We'll go see those chimpanzees. Why do you need chimpanzees when you have a clown right in front of you, little girl? They're married. They took vows. They have a child. I will always love you. Oh. Makes it so much harder when you don't. Uh, the little lady wants to go to the zoo, so I thought you could take her. Sarah, she, I mean, at least she knows that something's not right, so do whatever you can to help me. But you're going to another woman every single day. When you're with me, you're with me. Leave your family at home where they belong. I'm trying. I'm trying, Olivia. Girl, what is wrong with you? You're with me, you're with me. You went after a married man. What did you expect? You trust me, and trust Fallon. He protects the things that I care about. Edison's evil. He would have done something like this. I didn't think it was necessary to tell Edison's man about the box. You will find what you are looking for in this box. But today I tested the machine. He's gonna make a clone and then kill it. But here at the turn, I must leave you, Borden, sitting there in your cell for my murder. 
He must have killed the clone then. My tricks. You get the rest of it when you bring my daughter here. I'll tell her I know what you, you tell her what? I know what you really are, Alfred. Sarah, <laughs> shut up! I don't wanna hear her anymore! You're the one hurting her. I want you to be honest with me. Do you love me? Not today. No. No. She deserved better. She was tortured by him. She just loved him. He couldn't just be normal to her. I'm looking for an old friend. I heard about a booking. You're back. It's my last show. The real transported man. I need you to call in any favors or connections you have left to get us the right booking for the run. You tell me you only wanted to show me one trick. It piqued my interest. Well, let's get on, shall we? He simply disappears. There has to be a, a prestige. Exactly. But you'll have to dress it up a little. A little. He's literally in like a d d d destroyed thing. You haven't spoken about her. I never loved Sierra. Part of me did, but the other part didn't. It's inhuman to be so cold. He's back. You should go to him to deserve each other. This girl really was like, what can I do that's best for me everywhere? Just messed up everybody's lives and then just dipped. The world, ladies and gentlemen, is on the brink of new and terrifying possibilities. If we listen to Tesla. What you're about to witness is not magic, it is purely science. So is he the clone or is the clone dead? Because one of them. I. I. Okay, I don't know. I'm just gonna watch the movie. No talent magician, and they're calling him the bloody best in England. Why can't you outthink him? They do this every night after each performance. We're done. Because there's a dead guy in there. That's why. I told you, John. I don't want you backstage on this one. Oh, oh the bloody axe, you fool! And that's how they trap him into thinking that he murdered him. So none of them are the real him at this point. But they retain the memories. This is insane. This is literally the craziest thing ever. Hey! He tried to help him! So they did it. You have been found guilty of the murder of Robert Andrew. Do you think I could talk to Lord Cordlow in person? Out of the question. I suppose if in the course of your delivery arrangements, your paths were to cross. Thank you. Hello, my love. Daddy, can I come in there? Everything is going to be all right. Cordlow, I always have been. All I wanted to do was prove that I was a better magician. He stole his life. I don't know what you've done, but you're not afraid to get your hands dirty anymore, are you? No, not anymore. He stole his life, so he's gonna steal his. No. Come on, darling. No, 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 stop, no. Yeah. Your secret? Yeah. You always were the better magician. But whatever your secret was, mine is better. I'm gonna take you home, soon. Wait, this is horrible. This is so dark and depressing. He didn't even murder his wife on purpose. Angela! Hello, Cutter. I saw you on a slab, for God's sake. I tried not to involve you. You, 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 he was the villain all along. Like, I, he was just so obsessed. And then once he realized what he could do, he took this man's life on purpose. His was an accident. You were right. I should have left him to his damn trip. Sorry about Sarah. Good boy. Are you watching closely? I once told you about a sailor who described drowning to me. He said it was agony. And that's what he did to a bunch of clones of himself and what happened to his wife. Alfred Borden, this day in the name of the King and the High Court of England, you will meet your end. No one cares about the man in the box. Twins all along. 
<gasps> and that's the key to the trick. It was just that he had a twin that he always covered up. Cut a new. But I told him it was too simple. It was too easy. Simple might be, but not easy. I can't see that. I can't watch. I can watch. I can watch. I can watch. And her and her wife. We each loved one of them. I regret saying everything I said about them. We each had half of a full life, which was enough for us, but not for them. She sacrificed Robert. That's the price of a good trip. Oh my lord. I've made sacrifices. It takes nothing to steal another man's work. Oh, wait, I'm not he had to kill himself a hundred times over. You didn't see where you are, did you? Okay. The audience knows the truth. Every magic trick consists of three parts. The first part is called the pledge. The second act is called the turn. But you wouldn't clap yet because making something disappear isn't enough. That's why I made that promise. Now you're looking for the secret. But you won't find it because of course, you're not really looking. He's gonna find the bodies. You don't really want to work it out. You want to be fooled. Holy smokes, that was a, a messed up movie. That was so friggin' messed up. Genuinely one of the most effed up movies I think I've ever watched. I'm not even kidding. I gotta sit here and think about this. Like, my heart is pounding. The last time I had a feeling like this was when I watched... Fight Club. Oh, it's put me through so much stress. Oh, it's so good, but what the fudge, man. Okay, it was Michael Caine. So I just finished watching The Prestige. I hate that I am extremely emotional right now because I feel like I can't give an accurate review without having my emotions infect what I, I want to think. So it's like I can't really separate my emotions from my thoughts. Christopher Nolan garnered such an emotional response that I, I feel like I can't even think straight. So that was one of the most effed up movies I have seen in a long, long time. Actually ever. This was extremely well done. It was mind bending. Like it destroys your mind, right? Like this whole time you're thinking Robert, Hugh Jackman's character is like this good guy, only for him to like kind of show his true colors at the very end of the day. And then all along, it was a simple trick. Oh my gosh, this is so messed up. And that's why this, it's like he had person. So, <sighs> Freddie, he had two separate personalities because he was two separate people. Each of the brothers had to live half a life. So that's why there were two opposing sides of a coin. He wasn't bipolar, he didn't suffer from anything. He, he just had to keep it a secret and live it. I'm so sorry that I was like yelling things and like just like, oh, that's gonna happen, that's gonna happen and trying to like rationalize things. Dang, I did not see that coming. For a movie to invoke such emotion like this is insane. Like, I don't remember last time I felt this way. Like it, it makes me like almost, I'm so anxious, I'm almost mad. Like I feel like I'm internally vibrating because of how nervous it made me. And with an ending like that, we're, no one really wins. Robert dies. One of Freddy's die. Like the Freddy's twin, Frederick, <laughs> dies. Brenda Rice. She un unalived herself because she thought that her husband was having an affair and leaving a double life, but it was just his twin. And he couldn't, he could have saved her life by just explaining it all to her, but then it, all of the illusion would be gone. Dude, I thought she deserved better. You know what? She ended, she did deserve better because she deserved a man who trusted her. <laughs> who trusted her enough to say that he had a twin. Do you see how conflicted I am right now? That was amazingly done. That was amazing. I'm so triggered. I am beyond words right now, but I have to say that the performances were beautiful. The story, mind-blowing. Like, you could not even predict that. There's no way. Like, you think it's going this way, and then you're right, and then they're like, JK. Sharp right turn, or left turn, whichever side you want. So, I gotta say, that was a really, really, really good, effed up, but really good movie. I loved it. I drank too much caffeine today, so that, that, that's bad. Okay, so I made it worse on myself. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for picking it. That was insane oh my gosh whoa i hope you guys enjoyed if you guys have any insight tidbits any anything you want to say at all 
just let me know because like I love reading your comments. I love hearing your perspectives. I love hearing the stories that you have when you watch these films. And if you have anything that you have to, that you care to share on how I can improve, be sure to let me know. I love constructive criticism. Don't be mean. Let me know down below in the comments. Thank you guys so incredibly much for watching. Um, and I'll hopefully see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone.